as my colleague has said, what the communities have told us is that the conflict here in this North Rift region, especially among communities, has taken such an endemic character to the point that it has been normalized. People just think the conflict, it's normal. What do you expect? It's uh, the pastoralist communities that are fighting, and that's what they do. But as a Human Rights Commission, we won't uh, uh, take that approach. We won't sit back and um, just watch this very productive and very vibrant part of the country, the conflict here being treated as if it was just a part of a routine, normal cultural practice. We want to put a human rights face to the conflict, and that is what we think we are doing differently. We are not doing this like everybody else has done. We are looking at the cause. What is the real cause of the, this violation in terms of people's livelihoods, in terms of the access to the basic amenities, schools, hospitals? What does it cause, for example, if somebody is injured and they are brought to Moit teaching referral here, how much do they pay for costs? Uh, and we are computing all that. And yesterday it was very interesting when we were in Kapenguria, just asking uh, the, uh, the duty bearers who are there. In one case, they told us Mbuzi Elfumbili Walibwa, 2,000 goats got lost. So we were asking them out of curiosity, how much does this one goat cost? Average Elfutano. Now if you take 2,000 goats, at 5,000 and they are all lost. That is 10 million gone. Now in other parts of the country, if you're computing things that way, that is just one case. Imagine the sheer wealth that has been lost and taken to be normal just because of the conflict. So those are the things we are computing. And as my colleague said, at the end of the day, we have uh, gotten very good interaction from the community, from the political, uh, no, from the, um, uh, the state actors, in Ministry of Education, Health and all that and we are very confident that the recommendations that will come out of this will be transformative in that they, we, are, we are not doing this same old so we are doing this differently. Findings, what we got on the ground and what we are saying is that uh, it's going to be different in the sense that it is going to be targeted uh, the recommendations will also be time bound and they will also be costed just to allude to what my colleague said for example, in certain areas, we found that um, there is a problem of uh, security agencies' response whenever an issue is reported. Let's say like a conflict is occurring in another area. Then you find on the ground that they have to cover very vast regions, and that is why the response is slow. So maybe uh, as an example, I would say that we can uh, give recommendations that uh, maybe more police posts, maybe uh, more police officers, and this is the cost implication, and this should be done within a certain time frame.